All right, guys, everybody, Ken Dips here. Today we're doing a comparison of the S18 Pro versus my 16X. Uh, some of you guys have wanted to know. So I'll tell you right now, uh, I enjoy both of these wheels really uh, a lot. And if you look at the profile, they're about the same size. So the S18 uh, Pro here is a little bit slightly wider. So you can see just for the tail part for the suspension. But height wise, they're actually about the same guys. So just a slightly, maybe an inch taller on this one. Uh, and that's because, you know, it has the suspension. So, but if you look at it, it's actually about the same. Let's go down for this. Look at that profile there. Pretty much about the same size. Uh, the tire, of course, is bigger, but um, yeah, spec wise, they both have a uh, 2,200 watt hour, uh, 2,200 watt motor. Um, but this here has a uh, higher peak uh, output, so it uh, does about 5,000 um, output. This, I'm not too sure what the output is on 16X, but they both have really good acceleration. This one's faster. This one's like, like in terms of acceleration and torque, this one's better because it has the mall cell batteries. Um, it does have that higher continuous discharge, so uh the 16x is actually pretty good because the tire is smaller you don't really notice the difference in acceleration like this goes like this goes as well so they both go but i when i ride i notice this is slightly a bit better so and we're talking about like minuscule you know in terms of performance it is better now keep in mind because a smaller wheel you're gonna get more torque anyways but this has the this is so imagine this having a bigger wheel and as much or more torque than the 16x that's what the acceleration feels like so um, it's actually quite profound compared to my original s18 which was not kind of lackluster guys so um that's why if you ever watch my older videos you'll uh, on my s18 you'll always i always uh, tell you guys like it's really kind of slow <laughs> so and that's because it had the original um batteries in it it was all right it was a nice cruiser wheel and i always said that and it just doesn't have the power so and then some comments were like oh really you have no power on your s18 i'm like yeah i have no power uh you know they probably you know they probably had the the higher end s18 pro so um yeah, but it does have power when you have the newer one, and it does make quite a big difference. Now, which one do I enjoy more? Oh, that's a tough call. You know, even though this has no suspension, I actually love this wheel. Okay, so the reason why is because it's so convenient, the trolley handle, I can take it wherever I want. Uh, it rides really smooth, even with no suspension. The bumps on the road and things like that ride really smooth with this wheel. So... Um, it's an it's an amazing wheel guys like a lot of people have ditched uh, the 16x for like you know higher end wheels but I don't know I, I don't think I could ever sell it so because of the fact that it's so convenient so reliable and it's just a really good wheel uh, like even though it has no suspension and like I said you don't really need suspension this would this goes really well like yeah it just rides really well guys so um, this rides really well too so they're both nimble they're both easy to ride they're both easy to maneuver they're they're pretty much lightweight wheels they're both the same weight this one's maybe about four pounds lighter so um yeah it's a tough call if i had to choose one oh if i had to choose one i'd probably keep the s18 so um but if i'm not i would keep this as much as i i as long as i could uh because it does have a longer battery uh, like a bigger battery 1500 watt hours versus this and I get way more range I get about 80 to 100 kilometers on this thing so this I would probably get about remember it's only 900 watt hours so I get about 65 um, it's quite a big difference so now with my older s18 of course I get pretty good range on that one too so um, but yeah it just it's just not as fun because it doesn't have the power uh, but this has the power it has the acceleration and has more range so why, why wouldn't you keep this and this is lightweight it's easy uh it's, you know it's, it's a easy to ride wheel it's lightweight why wouldn't you keep it and it's really great for getting errands and stuff so of course i have a falcon for that too so the falcon's fine 
uh, but it, this has the fancy RGB lights, by the way, and it actually comes in handy when it gets really dark out. So especially now during the winter, uh, this is probably the wheel I'll, I'll, I would ride just because it has the RGB. I don't want to get hit by a car. So yeah, this is, it's another reason to have that one. Um, but yeah, all right, guys. Um, hmm. Price wise, if you can get this on sale, yes, this would be the one to buy. Uh, but if you can get this on sale, that's what the one buy. So it just depends on the price uh, and how much you like suspension and how much range you would really want. Um, if you're if you're wanting like you know you're like oh I need a I need to commute for at least you know 50 kilometers. Well, that one would probably be the one I would get. So, and it's probably like half the price uh, of this now because this is an older wheel. They're both older wheels, but this is much this is much older than this one. So. Um, well, maybe about a year, so a year or two. So, uh, but they did. This is the this is the newer version because it's a limited edition. They actually have the pedals, the upgraded sensors, and everything. <clears throat> they do have a newer version of the S18 Pro Plus. It's called, and it has the new controller, has everything that's like brand new. So, uh, but they still use the same parts. So some people have commented it's re it's really hard to take this apart, and I believe them. Look at look at all those screws and stuff. So. Um, and maintenance wise it's probably easier to have this as maintenance as well guys all right hopefully that helps you guys out if you have any questions comments post below subscribe to the channel